The following is a special presentation produced by WBBZ-TV in partnership with the Erie County Fair, supported by the fair and their sponsors. It's time for Fair Day Live, everything you need to know about the Erie County Fair with interesting people, places, and events at the Hamburg Fairgrounds. With that and more surprises, here is Kim Piazza. Welcome to Fair Day Live. I'm Kim Piazza, and there are so many things for you to do here in Hamburg at the Erie County Fair. And some of those fabulous and fun things are the new food showdown celebrity judging today at 11.30 a.m. in the Erie County Fair Cook's Kitchen and Shop. Download all the new fairground apps, because you got to vote. Erie County Fair Talent Show on the Tops Avenue of Flag Stage. Maxi Division starts at 11 a.m. with the Mini Division immediately to follow. Open Class Swine Show at 12 p.m. in the Showplex. And, can't forget, Chris Young, come get your country on in the Buffalo.com Grandstand at 7.30 p.m. Yesterday morning, we were greeted here at the fair with what we like to call liquid sunshine, because we don't really want to call it rain, not in Buffalo, liquid sunshine. But our first fair fans were greeted with at the open gates, and we had a chance to speak with, uh, to greet, to meet, and enjoy some time with marketing manager Marty Beyonce, the fair band, and the ultimate fair goer kicked off the whole event. Take a look. Ladies and gentlemen, this year, 2018, marks the 150th anniversary of the Erie County Fair taking place right on this property. It was in 1868 that the fair board decided to move the fair from Springville, where it was held for a couple years, close, closer to the city of Buffalo, to this property right behind me. This racetrack, the Hamburg Driving Association Park, was around in the 1860s with harness racing. And they invited the fair board to come. And it was one of the wisest decisions that was ever made to bring the fair this close into Hamburg. Why? Because we came closer to the city of Buffalo and that population. We were able to become that link, that bridge, between the agrarian towns and communities in society and the urban center of western New York. We still are that bridge today through our agricultural buildings and, and ed education. To tell us a little bit more, I'd like to introduce in her first year as the CEO and fair manager of the Erie County Fair, of the Erie County Agricultural Society, Mrs. Jessica Underberg. Jessica. Thanks, Marty. Thanks, everybody, for being here. About 10 months ago, 11 months ago, the staff got together and we talked about what we do, why we do it, can we do it better, and do we need to do it at all. When you walk through the fairgrounds today, you're going to see a different layout to the fair than you're used to. I encourage you, if you see something not in the same location as it's always been, look around. They're probably still here, just in a different spot. I am uh, very grateful for a very supportive board and a very supportive staff, and I hope that you'll see our our projects on the inside. Thank you. I'd like to introduce Tom Moses and thank him for being host to our fair for over 150 years. Tom. Thank you very much. It's a real honor to be here today and I want to congratulate the fair for all the upcoming events that they have. And it's also, they do so much year round and people don't realize they're here not only for fair time, but all the time during the course of the year. So again, I want to thank them for everything they do, and God bless and hope they have a good, good week and success. Thank you. Next, rep representing a county that we're all proud of. It's in our name. So many people from Erie County, from all corners, are going to be coming, and everybody from Western New York, from Western New York State, who attends. I'd like to introduce our county executive, Mark Polencars. Mark, thank you so much for being here. Thank you, Marty. Good afternoon, everyone. On behalf of the people of Erie County, it is my pleasure to be here. I have a proclamation. I'm hiding it because I don't want to get it too wet. 
but uh, I do uh, thank each and every one of the representatives from the fair for the great work that they do to, it truthfully, it is a tourism draw for this greater community. People come in from all over the area to the Erie County Fair, and it's because of the tremendous work that is done by the staff here from the Erie County Agricultural Society. Uh, in the proclamation, I note that this is the 150th anniversary of the fair being held in Hamburg, and I honor the fair for doing that, and I'm proud to declare the next 12 days in Erie County, New York, the days of the Erie County Fair. Congratulations, and hopefully this is the last shower for the next 12 days. The state, under Governor Cuomo's leadership and with the support of the legislature, has awarded three rounds of funding for county and local fairs totaling $15 million. This funding will help with repairs, complete construction projects, and buy new equipment. We are happy to see many of those projects underway, and some of them have already been completed. So on behalf of Governor Andrew Cuomo and the department with Commissioner Richard Ball, we thank you for your hard work to make the fair a continued success and for keeping the longstanding tradition of agriculture at the forefront for the thousands of people who come to visit. Thank you. The Erie County Agricultural Society is one of the oldest non-for-profit and community-driven organizations in the history of our community. I'd like to introduce our board of directors, Mr. Bob Brunner. Bob. Thank you, Marty. Thank you, everybody. And standing behind me are a couple of the fellow board members I'd like to just uh, quickly introduce for you. Uh, Wesley Duss, Mr. Uh, Dick Campbell, Mr. John Lemer, Charlie Kelkenberg, Joe Solomon, and Harry Lockwood. Let's give them a round of applause. These guys do a wonderful job year-round with our CEO, Jessica Underberg, to make these grounds as beautiful as they are. So again, we thank you all for being here and enjoy the rain. It's going to be a heck of a day for us. Speaking of people, there's a rare breed of fairgoer out there who lives and breathes the Erie County Fair, not just for 12 days out of the year, but all 365 days. Established in 2005, the Erie County Fair's ultimate fairgoer honor is bestowed each year on an individual is who not only is passionate and enthusiastic about the Erie County Fair, but actively promotes and shares their love with friends and family in the community. The chosen candidate is the greatest fair fan in Western New York who lives and breathes the Erie County Fair. This year's ultimate fair goer has been attending the Erie County Fair every single year since the mid 1950s. She has been selected by the Erie County Fair as the individual who's most passionate and enthusiastic about the fair. Judy has been an active member of the fair as a volunteer with the Food Bank of Western New York for selling Johnsonville hots, collecting food donations at the gate. Her dedication doesn't stop there. She has taken over 1,600 photographs of the fair, and that's only counting her digital photography. Sharing her love of her fair, Judy posts her fair pictures on the Hamburg Chamber of Commerce website and also on her own pages that reaches close to 30,000 people. She also promotes the fair at the Hamburg Chamber of Commerce tourism meetings and is really is a true proponent. Ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to introduce to you this year's 2008 Ultimate Fairgoer. How about a big round of applause for Judy Wilder, everybody. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Judy Wilder, our Ultimate Fairgoer. I see we've got some of our other Ultimate Fairgoers are here. You are now inducted into the UFGs, as we call them. You will notice they've got a small encampment at uh, inside Slade Park. Judy, congratulations. There'll be many honors over the next 12 days. Thank you for supporting and keeping the fair in mind all year long. Thank you so much. Big round of applause for Judy, everybody. First of all, go on the website and map out your day, that you can get the most out of your day if you know where you're going and, and, and what you want to do. And then, oh goodness, the key points, uh, if you especially enjoy food, you know, take a look at the different food vendors, uh, look at the different categories. If animals are the most important thing, you know, map out your strategy for checking out the animals or map out your strategy if you want to see the arts and crafts. And then, you know, plan your day around those things and then whatever time you have left, you can spread out and do other things. Ladies and gentlemen, on behalf of the Erie County Agricultural Society, welcome to the 12 days of summer. The 179th Erie County Fair is officially open.
thank you to the marketing manager, Marty Biniaz, the fair band, and the ultimate fair goer, Judy Wilder. We'll be right back here at the Erie County Fair after this short break. Fair Day Live continues after this. The best 12 days. The best. Days of summer are here. It's the 179th Erie County Fair, August 8th through the 19th. See what we've got packed into 12 days of sensational sizzling summer fun. The best shows. The best finds. And don't forget. The best animals. Summertime's best food. The best times. Nothing says summer like the best 12 days of summer at this year's Erie County Fair. Old man winter is coming. Are you ready? When it comes to your snow removal equipment, you need a dealer that does more than just sell a plow. Then it's time for you to visit General Welding and Fabricating, Inc., an authorized boss dealer. Not only can we help you choose from the best products in the snow removal industry, but we're also your go-to guys when it comes to answering all your boss questions. This week, stop at General Welding's 10 at the Erie County Fair and take advantage of the lowest pricing of the year. Save up to $400 off any installed in-stock boss snow removal equipment. Choosing a bank that's the right fit for your personal or professional needs requires serious consideration. Lakeshore Savings is a local bank with big banking products and no intentions to outgrow our home in western New York. We believe we're just the right size and we intend to keep it that way. Earn up to 1.5% with a qualifying balance when you open an LS Premium Money Market Savings account. Stop in or visit online to get started today. Banking with your best interest in mind. It's how we do business. America's most iconic quartet is coming live to perform their unforgettable hits. The Oak Ridge Boys Shine the Light Tour 2018, August 13th at the Erie County Fair Buffalo.com Grandstand. Get reserved seats at Tickets.com, the fairgrounds main office, or by phone. There's more at OakRidgeBoys.com, part of the National Grid Concert Series. Welcome back to Fair Day Live. Welcome back to the Erie County Fair. Do you love to eat at the fair? I love to eat at the fair. <laughs> You're going to love this segment. We have with us Amy Laskevich. Hello, Amy. Hi. And you, you serve some wonderful goodies here at the fair. And uh, you're with Jack's Delicious delicious <laughs> fries and delicious fries on Broadway that's Correct. right because all of the different roads and sections here in the fair have names mm -hmm. all right so we have something yummy in front of us so come over here come closer to the food Amy all right. tell us what this wonderful goodie is yeah so we have apple quesadillas they're new this year and they are to die for if you're coming for? out to the fair you've got to try them to so, die for yeah they've like got like a funnel cake on the outside they're sprinkled with powdered sugar they've got a nice icing drizzle on the top and then inside we've got the tortilla shell and it's got okay. a wonderful apple filling on the inside so you're talking about this whoopsie you're talking about you're talking about this here's our drizzle yes and if i yes. break this open yep. i'm going to find some the yummy inside. gooey ooey apple yes. goodness you know so with the apple filling, as far as fair food goes, this is actually health food. Right. Yeah, you can have right. it for breakfast, right? It's like a right. pastry oh, in the yeah, morning. Yeah, and yes. since I broke it open, I can go like that, and the calories, they all fall out. Exactly. Okay, I thought so. Fat-free, so. calorie-free. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. We'll just keep telling ourselves <laughs> that, Amy. This Sounds is good. super yummy. So you said this is new to the fair. It is new to the fair this year, Because yes. we're, you know, we're all familiar with fair food, but yep. when you come to the Erie County Fair, one of the fun things to do is to find new things absolutely whether it's to eat or to purchase or new people to meet mm -hmm. so just more yummy food talk to me a little bit about where you work because i think the word fry <laughs> Yeah. Who's in there? So our, our company started out as a fry business and then expanded into the taco world. And then my dad wanted to create something that was a taco themed dessert to go along with the tacos. So he came up with the dessert quesadilla. So this idea. is your dad's um, yes, dessert baby. Yes, his little project. Way to yes. go dad. What's your yeah. dad's name? Jim. Jim Feld. Well done, Jim. Well yeah. done. So mm -hmm. how many years has uh, your family been here at the fair making yummy treats? 
Okay, well, this is actually, we're into the fourth generation now. So we've been here for 59 years. Wow. We've been doing tacos for 15 of those 59 years. So, so you yeah, guys it's a tradition. Are, yeah, yeah, you're like a big part of the yeah. fair. You have multiple locations throughout the fair, mm -hmm. but not every location has this yummy treat. Correct. Yes. So how do we find this, this is, particular yummy yeah, treat? Yeah, this is going to be on Broadway, and it's going to be in a bright green and um, purple tent, and it's the taco, taco in a bag stamp. So, so. easy to find. Oh, yeah, very easy Bright to find. Bright green and purple. Wait, yeah. did you say taco in a bag? Taco in a bag. Mm -hmm. That is so perfect for the fair. It, it is. carried around and yes. eat your treats. Yep, yep. Okay, so 59 years, you guys obviously know what you're doing. Yeah. 59 years here at the fair on Broadway. What ha what, what else can you tell us? What, what haven't we talked about with our yummy turnovers? Well, like I said, they're going to be like the perfect ending to your meal, whatever you want. Is or a the meal, beginning so. of your meal. That's true, too. Beginning and end. You know, oh. that works, too. Thank you so much, <laughs> Thanks Amy. For Thanks for coming yeah. in. And don't forget fries. They also have fries. Yes. Yes. So uh, stay with us. We will be right back with Fair Day Live. Davis. Days of summer are here. It's the 179th Erie County Fair, August 8th through the 19th. See what we've got packed into 12 days of sensational sizzling summer fun. The best shows. The best rides. And don't forget. The best animals. Summertime's best food. The best times. Nothing says summer like the best 12 days of summer at this year's Erie County Fair. There's a bank in our community that saves you money wherever you are. A bank where people right here answer the phone and spend time with you to answer your questions. A bank that has proudly served Western New Yorkers for more than 90 years and counting. Evans Bank. Experience a better way. America's most iconic quartet is coming live to perform their unforgettable hits. The Oak Ridge Boys Shine the Light Tour 2018, August 13th at the Erie County Fair Buffalo.com Grandstand. Get reserved seats at tickets.com, the fairgrounds main office, or by phone. There's more at OakRidgeBoys.com, part of the National Grid Concert Series. Welcome back to Fair Day Live. Welcome back to Fair Day Live. WBBZ TV is partnered with a wonderful not for profit organization uh, working here at the fair at our gazebo, at the WBBZ TV gazebo, which you know you've got to come and see us at the gazebo and spin our wheel. And here to tell us more is Matt Smith. Welcome, Matt. Matt is the Executive Director of Prevention Focus. It's nice to see you again, Matt. Thank you, Kim. Here we go, another fair. Another fair. We've spoken to Matt in the past. You mm -hmm. do such great work for us here in Buffalo. Let's start out by telling the folks at home what is your mission, Prevention okay. Focus? Prevention Focus has been making safe and healthy happen in Western New York since 1979. That's a long time. It is. It is. What we mostly focus on is substance abuse prevention, but our work also impacts mental health and, and, and physical health as well as we do it. We give people the skills and information they need to make safer and healthier choices, and we work to create environments where the safer and healthier choice is easier and therefore more likely. A lot of our work is in schools. We do different curriculum packages that give kids skills like decision making and problem solving and setting goals because these have been scientifically proven to increase the likelihood that kids can stay on a straight and narrow path and make good decisions. I think it's really interesting that um, you're going into schools to teach kids decision making mm -hmm. because I think as parents, I'm a parent, so many sure. people at home with families of their own, 
you think about teaching your kids math, you think about teaching your kids the ABCs, you, right. you know, you think about those kind of base um, building blocks, and it, you don't stop to think that the decision-making process is something that even can be taught. Oh, it can, absolutely. And, and kids aren't really automatically wired that way. Yeah. As anyone who's ever been around a young person knows, decision making isn't something that always comes along quick. But mm -hmm. So we want to make that faster earlier in their lives because you really can set them up for a path toward success if you can bolster those things. Stop and think. You Stop know, what, and what, think. what could possibly happen if I do A, B, or C? Um, these are skills that really help kids. And whether it's uh, t drying alcohol, tobacco, or other drugs, or picking up a rock and throwing it through a window, or joining a gang, mm -hmm. committing a crime, all these things are impacted by how well a kid makes decisions. So you're trying to um, help people to understand that the decision that is made today mm -hmm. affects tomorrow and the next day and perhaps the rest of your life. Correct. Because of particularly young people, they just don't have context mm -hmm. for their actions. Right. And as adults, we try to help give them that. And the trick is to start when they're very, very young. Our programs go in kindergarten, mm -hmm. all the way up through high school. We even do some work with adults in our, in our work as well. And so. so are you all over Western New York? We are in Erie County specifically, mm -hmm. um, with many different schools and community partners that we work with. About 5,000 young people a year uh, get our programs. And uh, what is your education plan for this fall? Well, we have a, a bunch of uh, schools that are right, right now being discussed as far as like getting the final plans made. But uh -huh. we have seven prevention specialists that all get full loads of work where they go into the schools to do our programs, uh, from especially in the elementary grades. So you've got some goodies in your I hand do, there, I Mr. Do. Matt. Because it's the Wheel of Fun. The Wheel of Fun? Wheel of Summer the Wheel Fun. Wheel of Fun? So yes. where would one find the Wheel of Fun? At, at the Erie County Fair, the WBBZ Wheel of Fun, because really that's the only wheel here that's truly fun. It is. The WBBZ Wheel of Fun. Officially. So where mm -hmm. do we find the Wheel of Fun? We're in front of the historical building facing the Grange Building, so if people are familiar with the fairgrounds, it's right there. It's a really little, good spot. It's a great spot. And we have a lot of friends come see us uh, every single day, and we're spinning the wheel for a dollar. It goes to our programs. and So the dollar goes straight to prevention focus, and prevention focus goes straight to the community. Correct. So that's Correct. a really great investment. I but that dollar so. gets you a spin, and that spin can get you some prizes. Yes, it absolutely does. So We've what's a, in your hand there, Well, sir? I've got a couple of things. Um, first of all, um, anyone who plays our game, because everyone is a winner, okay? Everyone who plays our game is going to get, at the very least, a wonderful coupon good for a dollar off Salvatore's Pizza right here on the fairgrounds. Wait a minute, you mean our prizes can be used immediately on the fairground? That's, I love that. That's correct. I, think, I hope our customers like that And it too. can be used for food on the <laughs> fairground? That's a and, good wheel spin. And, and also from uh, Babsha's pierogies. So, so these two right here, they, they no get one what, or the other. No matter what, you're going to get these. Exactly these right. So you've coupons. already won before you even play. So that dollar you've already gotten back in these fair, in these fair food coupons. Correct. And um, we have a wheel mm -hmm. with 18 spaces on it. I believe today three of them are going to have the WBBC Buffalo, Buzzy Buffalo logo head on them. Okay. Anyone lands in the Buzzy Buffalo, they're reaching into our prize box to get an additional prize. Nice. So what we've are got, what are our oh, potential got, well, additional prizes? First of prizes. all, this drawstring bag is one of them, suitable oh for back goodness. to school. We've okay, got frisbees, so frisbee. oh, I love tumblers. Bees. Coffee. Uh, that's, that's a bandana from our friends at the National Guard Counter Drug Unit. Uh, sports bottles. I, see, I think I see some really, really cool I brought, sunglasses. I thought, I thought of you when yeah, I saw you did. those. You thought of me when you saw these Absolutely. sunglasses. That's fantastic. We've got many flashlights. We also have some uh, pri <laughs> prizes from sponsors as well. There's a $20 um, uh, coupon from Dave and Buster's that people could win. And another coupon that's 10% off your whole food bill when you go to dinner or lunch at shops. So there's just something for everyone. Lots well, of prizes. Well, ladies and gentlemen, come check out our gazebo. And mm -hmm. uh, we have to take a short break, but we'll be right back. Fair Day Live continues after this. The best 12 days. The best. Days of summer are here. It's the 179th Erie County Fair, August 8th through the 19th. See what we've got packed into 12 days of sensational sizzling summer fun. The best shows. The best rides. And don't forget. The best animals. Summertime's best food. The best times. Nothing says summer like the best 12 days of summer at this year's Erie County Fair. Discover a world of magic and wonder where you can imagine all sorts of new adventures and endless possibilities where you can find what you need for everything from late night soothing snuggles to meeting a new best friend. Come to Fisher Price. There's always fun in store. Eat 
quality. Save money. Eat fresh. Save time. Eat right. Eat right foods. Buffalo's premier meal prep service. Order today at eatrightfoods716.com. America's most iconic quartets is coming live to perform their unforgettable hits. The Oak Ridge Boys Shine the Light Tour 2018. August 13th at the Erie County Fair Buffalo.com Grandstand. Get reserved seats at Tickets.com, the fairground's main office, or by phone. There's more at OakRidgeBoys.com, part of the National Grid Concert Series. Welcome back to Fair Day Live. Thanks for joining us today. And remember to check out our wheel at the WVBZ Gazebo and all of the wheels from all of the different media outlets that are here today. So many goodies, so many prizes. But as well as the goodies and the prizes, all of the things that are going on today. The new food showdown celebrity judging today at 1130 a.m. in the Erie County Fair Cooks, Kitchen, and Shop. Don't download all the new fairgrounds apps and remember to vote 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 erie county fair has a talent show on the tops avenue of flag stage the maxi division starts at 11 a.m with the mini division immediately to follow open class swine show at 12 p.m in the showplex and come out and get your country on with chris young in the buffalo.com grandstand at 7 30 p.m so ladies and gentlemen so much to do here at the fair so many people to see so much so much to eat so much to drink so much to ride on come see our friend matt from prevention focus what a great way to spend What's nearly the end of the summer, as much as we hate to say, the end of the summer, Matt. Mm -hmm. Come on down to the Erie County Fair. And thank you for joining us here on Fair Day Live. And watch every morning. We're coming to you at 8.30 a.m. on WBVZ-TV. Or you can stream us live on the Erie County Fair page and on Facebook. So we'll be looking for you tomorrow. We'll be looking for you at our gazebo. Matt will be there with his bag of goodies. Enjoy the rest of your day. Thanks for watching Fair Day Live. The preceding presentation was produced by WBBZ-TV in partnership with the Erie County Fair, who paid a production fee for the program with sponsor support.